The next 48 hours could be decisive for the future of Interpol. Police chiefs from around the world are gathering at the organization's annual meeting in Istanbul. Interpol has 194 member countries, all of them vying for influence. The Global Police Agency coordinates policing between countries, hunting down drug traffickers, people smugglers, war criminals and terror suspects. But the body's divisive leadership election is exposing Interpol's bitter fault lines. Critics say repressive regimes are using Interpol as a vehicle to hunt down political dissidents. One of the candidates for president, Major General Ahmed Nasser al-Raisi, is accused of being involved in torture and arbitrary detentions in the United Arab Emirates. Criminal complaints have been filed against him in five countries, including in France, where Interpol is based. Matthew Hedges was imprisoned in the UAE for nearly seven months on spying charges. He told France 24 his detention was akin to torture. It absolutely fulfills conditions of torture. I was psychologically abused. Um, I was held in solitary confinement for, for the entirety of my uh, time. I was threatened with, with physical punishment. China is also pushing its own candidate for a seat on the body's executive committee. Rights groups say Hu Binchen's election could put thousands of Chinese political dissidents abroad at risk.